Hi, my name's Neil. I work for a company called SICK, and here we're today at the Future Robotics Show. And in terms of what we're showcasing, is we're show showcasing our collaboration with our SICK Vision Systems alongside collaborative robots. You can see here we have two robots, Vision Systems encased in the cell here, and we're showing randomized bin picking of parts along with belt picking, uh, belt picking and this is a complete automation solution with regards to general manufacturing and industry. Um, and this is something that we've worked in collaboration with a number of robot manufacturers around the world to make sure we're all working towards the same goal of adding the value and the benefits to the customer. SICK is enabling companies and industries to adapt to what we would call Industry 4.0 by making sure that all of those extra small marginal gains in terms of getting data, being able to process everything at a higher level and talk to the enterprise level and cloud levels is all possible with SICK based solutions. And we see, we've been doing that for a number of years actually, even before let's say the, the advent of the, of the term Industry 4.0. And we believe it's a strong part of where industry is going to grow in the future and, when, and the direction of it um, in terms of where we're moving towards. In terms of my view on the adoption of Industry 4 by UK manufacturers, um, I, think, I think a lot of people are getting on board with it now. I think a lot of companies, a lot of suppliers are working with it on board. Um, and I think now is the case of we need to be communicating to the customers, to our customers, to businesses and to industry, what those benefits and what those added values can do for their, their particular industries and customers. Because I think that's the message that perhaps the industry suppliers, from our perspective, potentially could be doing more. And I think we are doing more with shows like this. And I think we should, we should be doing a lot more of it in the future. Thanks very much.